Hey guys, Brooke and Eli here. We just want to get a little bit of context on this video before it starts, so it makes a little bit more sense. So since we do foreclosed property management, we do quite a bit of different things. Mm -hmm. Anything from managing properties to taking photos for banks so that they know that you know the houses aren't abandoned. In this video, we do something called an occupancy check. Mm -hmm. It's which uh, the bank gives us an address that, of a home that we have to check out and drop off a letter. So usually Brooke does, does those herself. Mm -hmm. Sometimes I come with her as well. Uh, we got some late ones last night that were a rush, so I'll let Brooke kind of explain more on what those are. Yeah, so a rush occupancy check is when the bank hasn't been able to get a hold of the homeowner at all. So we have to check and make sure that their house isn't abandoned. And yeah, so yeah. when we went to check on this one, there were some weird things that happened. That was really, <laughs> really weird. So uh, what we usually do is go in front of the house, uh, we'll kind of walk around and just make sure it's not abandoned or you know somebody broke in the house just double check things and we usually drive in the back alley because sometimes you can see if they left the place there's usually a lot of junk in the back or, yeah or you know. the grass is really long like yeah. that sort of thing yeah so yeah. we just you know double check everything and when we're in the back alley there's a random person dancing in the rain in the backyard yeah <laughs> which was really weird Never and we that. drove past twice, yeah. and both times he didn't look at us, even though we were, like, probably five feet away from him. Maybe more than that, but it yeah, was yeah. pretty close. Like, he yeah. could easily see us driving past, but he didn't stop looking at the sky the entire time. Yeah, it was it was pretty weird. Yeah, and it also looked like he was talking to the sky. It was so strange. Yeah. But we didn't want to video his face just in case he was actually the homeowner. Yeah. Yeah, we gotta like respect people's privacy. Yeah, obviously. and obviously, yeah, because their house is being foreclosed, that's kind of a big deal and embarrassing for a lot of people. Yeah, we just wanna respect people's privacy, and yeah. at the end of the day, this could happen to anybody. Yeah. It could even happen to us. Mm -hmm. And you know, we don't wanna put people's face all over the internet. Yeah. So uh, that's it for this video. <laughs> if you guys kinda wanna see more of what we do behind the scenes or like, you know, every day, Day in the life of Brooke and Eli. Yeah, if you guys want to see that, <laughs> let us know because like we love filming these videos. Yeah. But we haven't been so busy. Mm -hmm. So if you guys want to see like every single thing we do and more about us, let us know in the comments down below and we'll be sure to make more videos like that. Yes. So enjoy this short video. And if you guys have any questions, make sure to comment down below. See you guys again soon. Now we're seeing that this house is abandoned. Because we had to drop a letter off for the homeowner because they're uh, behind on payments. And the mortgage lender wanted us to drop it off tonight. It was urgent. And this is the house right here. The red one? No, this one right here oh. with the window boarded up. Uh, oh. There's something in the back That's alley. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's closed. Okay, so somebody is there. That's, well, what are they doing? What the heck were they doing? Were they just stretching? Yeah. That was really weird. That was Did really they weird. Yeah. I'm so confused. Yeah. <laughs> Good thing I wasn't like, snap, take a picture of you. Some houses here, actually. Yeah, no, I think there is. Okay, let's see. Some random person in the backyard, like stretching. Yeah. And it's raining. It's been raining all day. Yeah, it has. The person just doing stretches outside. Like, hey, to each your own, but. I'll just hold it down for now. What the fuck? That's so weird. That's so weird. What is he looking at? Is there an um, Wow, I'm weirded out. Yeah. That's really weird. That's weird. Okay. Oh, yeah. It's pouring rain, and there's a guy just standing in the backyard. Yeah. That's the weirdest thing. And he looked like he was talking to someone in the sky. Maybe he's just on drugs and he <laughs> is chilling in that backyard. Yeah, and they had a piece of paper on the door, Brooke said, that they're behind on rent. Yeah. Which is weird. Really weird. We're in a really cool neighborhood, though. We're near the university where we live. It's yeah, really it's old. really pretty. Even this back alley is kind of nice. Isn't old truck? <laughs> is that Mitsubishi? I don't know really cool neighborhood though yeah it's like eight o'clock we just finished watching a movie <laughs> yeah we went to the adams family yeah watch an old school movie we're really the only people in the movie theater well besides two others yeah okay. oh and look at this cool house that's for rent 
Isn't that cool? That'd be an awesome house to have. I like the style of it. It's that old school style. On for it. It's really cool. Huh. Anyways, that was our adventure for the evening. Yeah, <laughs> we had uh, two houses that uh, Brooke got emailed that were emergencies. Yeah. They wanted them checked tonight and letters dropped off. So anytime we had that happen is when they're behind on payment and the bank or the mortgage lender wants us to check the property ASAP. Yeah. So they rush it. We we got it late tonight, but they wanted it done today. So yeah, that's it for today. Mm -hmm. Until next time. Yes.